balance. Boom, boom. This sport, absolutely, you need an interest, interest. I'm interested in what? Learning something. Completing the journey of this semester. We are so excited. We are about to start. Why? Because you are here. <laughs> Morning, Juniper Christian School. Welcome back, everyone. How was you guys' uh, vacation? Let's say hi to everyone. I know it's online service, but <laughs> let's give a big high five to everyone. Let's say hi to your teachers, and teachers may say hi to students. Welcome back, welcome back. We miss you so much. As you know that, we all the times one of you guys have back I know you don't want it, but we want it. Do you know that? I miss you so much. Oh, a lot of people said no, who spawn. But I think I, I'm pretty sure a lot of students must miss me a lot. I believe. 오늘 신입생들 또 재학생들도 또 학부모님들도 함께 함께 참여해 주셔서 감사하고 특별히 오리엔테이션 week 또첫 번째. 예배 때 참석해 주셔서 진심으로 감사합니다. 오늘 이 시간에 여러분과 함께 재밌는 말씀 또 감동 있는 말씀 또 영감 있는 말씀을 함께 나누고자 합니다. 함께 영어로 또 한국어로 같이 섞어서 하면서 함께 나누고자 하오니 잘 이렇게 집중하시고 또 함께 열심히 응원하면서 기도하면서 함께 말씀 묵상했으면 좋겠습니다. I like to speak about uh, English and the Korean kind of bilingual sermon today. So please be with us and then concentrate on what you have to do. Let's open the uh, book of Acts chapter 20, 24. 사도행전 20장 24절 말씀 보도록 하겠습니다. 먼저 제가 영어로 읽도록 하겠습니다. Let me read the English version first and then move on the Korean version. But my life is worth nothing to me unless I use it for finishing the work assigned me by the Lord Jesus, the work of telling others the goodness about the wonderful grace of God. Amen. 나의 달려갈 길과 주 예수께 받은 사명 곧 하나님의 은혜의 복음을 증언하는 일을 마치려 하면은 나의 생명조차 조금 더 귀한 것으로 여기지 아니하노라. 아멘. Um, COVID-19, it actually this disease pandemic has changed entire world, a lot of things, substantial, you know, like time and even energy and a lot of things we put on the fixing this disease, you know, with a lot of people together. Even today in Korea, even other countries trying to get develop, invented what the vaccine to get rid of all the this disease pandemic. We pray that many, many people, the students, even the schools, they continue to open, even the business to uh, continue to you know, work together back to the normal life. We pray that one day, you know, it will be gone. And then, you know, without mask, we enjoy our time and then, you know, come to school and enjoy our study and hang out with our students and our teachers. COVID-19, this season, it is called uncertainty. Uncertainty. Um, did you have a good time you know, during the vacation season? Even the Chinese New Year, which is the uh, lunar, uh, lunar year. 우리 구정 때또 방학 기간 동안 코로나19 안에서도 여러분 재밌게 보내셨습니까? A lot of people say that, uh, you know, uh, stay home. Let's go Bangkok. So Bangkok, they stay home. Bangkok 같은, 아직의 같은데, 우리 아이들 집에서 가만히 있는 그런 모습들 많을 있으리라 생각됩니다. A lot of people cannot, you know, go outside, you know, sports, even you know, sometimes to hang out with the friends. Even the uh, this travel with the family members is hard. Why? It's a pandemic, the COVID-19. As you know that I love winter sports, snowboarding. That's one of my favorite sports. 
Unfortunately, our school, we could have the uh, three days winter, winter snowboarding skiing uh, trip last year. We're trying to postpone this trip to you know, take you to the uh, ski resort and having fun and then safe environment, but we couldn't make it. Just one day trip and a lot of kids, unfortunately, especially elementary school students, they couldn't go, they couldn't join because uh, we, we are not able to provide a lot of you know, uh, hands and also uh, personal training some sessions. So sorry about that, but make sure, we'll take you to the uh, next year, the ski resort. I mean, this year actually, uh, winter, uh, December season, uh, we will take you to the uh, ski resort together. Guess what? Today, I'd like to take you to ski resort right now, right now. So, um, you know, you're gonna see my transformation, which is the uh, snowboard gear, and then full, like, you know, dress code, which is the uh, snowboard and the board. So I'm ready to, I'm about to, you know, snowboarding with you guys. I will take you to the uh, nice ski resort. Let's go! <laughs> Ski resort. Look at this. You know, nice weather. Look at this mountain. The snow. Wow. Look at this. Wow. Top of the mountain. There's snow there. Wow. It's beautiful. Beautiful. Wow. Wow. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm ready to uh, snowboarding right now. This is my gear. I love it. Nightdecker and uh, you know my the goggle here. And uh, I'm about to you know snowboarding right now. Okay. So let me teach you how to do snowboarding, okay? All right, let me put it down. Okay, and then, okay, I will bind it here. And then I'll do that, okay. All right, so I'm going to, now it's like, you know, leave right now, okay? Okay, let's go. Oh, okay, look at this, all right, left side. Right side, okay, oh, oh, jump, oh, oh, I made a jump, oh, okay, all right, let me teach you what, you know, you have to remember snowboarding time, okay, first one, what you need that basic skills, basic skills, you need a strong legs, strong legs, oh, 화장실 갈때 이거 다리 되게 힘 세대, 그지, all right, strong legs, you know, you, you need to, when you're like, you know, like come down from the hill, especially the uh, high, like the, what do you call, um, intermediate or uh, advanced course, you need a strong leg. So before you, uh, you know, go to the uh, ski resort and the snowboarding time or skiing time, you need to exercise. Like run or, you know, walk or maybe if you leave an apartment, you gotta use the stairs like up to the 40, the floor, something like that. So you gotta use practice to build up your muscle on your legs. And next one is balance. So ski and the snowboard, like ski like, like this, right? Like, like this, you need to balance, balance. And the snowboard too, balance, balance. Boom, boom, balance, you need that, all right? So balance, this is the balance sports. So you need that. And then next one is practice. Uh, sometimes I know that like you want to go top of the mountain and then you know come down as you know as fast as you could. Wow, will you kind of enjoy the speed? Not good, not good. Oh, look at this! Look at this! This uh, you know Jason's kids here. They're passing. Oh, Jason, Jason! Oh, look at this! Oh, he he just you know he's getting better, but it's still you know he needs to develop more skills. Oh, look at it, Ida! Oh, passing right now, I'm passing Ida! Oh, Emily, Emily, are you? Now snowboarding right now, or it's like what? Oh, you what? Walking right now? Okay, just move, 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 move. Julie, Julie, Julie. Oh, go, 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 go. Okay, all right. I guess our kids. It's been about oh, oh, just like seven years right now that we go to the uh, snowboarding trip every year. So let's go to the, uh, the intermediate place. Okay, all right. Let's move on then to the next level because you've been practicing a lot. All right. Oh, one go. Oh. Why are you here? Huh? You must go to the, uh, the beginner class. I mean, the beginner course. Oh! Oh! Look at this. He fell down. Horribly, horribly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you don't know. You don't know. 
All right. So uh, intermediate, it's a little bit, you know, a little bit, well, what is called like different angle, and uh, you need more or less skills, you know, compared to the beginner you know, course. Of course, advanced course. Look, let's go to advanced course. Ooh, ooh, Monty, ooh, Monty, ooh, 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 you know, this sport, absolutely, you need an interest, interest. So interest, without interest, you cannot develop your skills, okay? So um, any sports like skiing, snowboarding, and you know, basketball, baseball, even study, what you need that interest, with interest. 흥미를 가져야지 운동을 할수 있는 운동. 그래서 아침에 일찍 나와서 운동도 하시고 또 열심히 좋은 것도 먹고 그래야 되는 거. So uh, what you need that uh, snowboarding the time, you need the humility and willingness. Um, you, your body, I'm about kind of 50 years old, so like you know, not like you. So if I uh, snowboarding like do a snowboarding like like you guys like more than six seven hours a day, my knees hurts. I know I'm willing, but I have to be. I have to acknowledge my my you know, age. But your time, your age, you know a lot of potential you know, to grow up or develop your skills. But keep in mind this one, even though your level is a beginner course, you go to the uh, advanced course, you may seriously face a lot of sort of dangerous situations. So you need to acknowledge your current level, humble, humility, what? You should really to learn more and more and more at the next level, next level, next level. So humility and willingness, definitely the two keywords for developing your skills, snowboarding. The last one, you, you developing your snowboarding or skiing the, the skills, the last one is what? The goal. You have to set the goal, maybe every season, how often you go to uh, the ski, ski resort, then how you know, many minutes that you have to spend your time. You know what, like I, I do, I love snowboarding, but once a year I go, then you know, not much you, know, you could experience you developing your, develop your skills. So, you know, at least like more than 10 times, 20 times, you, know, you used to set the goals, and you go there, and then every time, when you go there, and then set the goal, you want to develop your, maybe, let's say, balance skill, maybe a turn skill, jump skill, maybe speed skill, maybe your phone, you know, like basic skill, you need to set the goal, and then what, practice and practice, practice. So, it is important, okay? All right, let's go! Okay, okay, uh, it's time to, we're about to go back to JC's campus together, okay? All right, let's go! Woo! All right, how was, uh, you know, your snowboard trip? It was pretty good, isn't it? Yeah, exciting. It's very exciting. I love all the times. Uh, let me know if you want to go next time. I'll take you to the, uh, uh, you know, snow, uh, snowboarding trip, I mean, you know, ski resort place. Um, Reflection time, which means uh, what you you know saw the uh, snowboarding, uh, you know skills and a lot of you know the, the practice, you know interest, the, the humility, willingness, and you have to set the goals and then um, try to put more your you know efforts to develop your uh, you know snowboarding or skiing you know, skills. Uh, we are about to start a new semester, spring uh, semester. 2020 and 2021 spring uh, semester. Uh, a lot of students, especially elementary, middle and high school, even students and parents, uh, teachers, we do have, it is called the goal, life goal. And uh, as a Christian, as a Christian uh, community and school, we do have a goal for Jesus Christ. The same practice, same implication, I'd like to give you some advice. How we can start this semester? Basically, we need basic skills. Academic skill, which is a time management, and you need to manage your time. And all the time, when you go back home, when you go to school, and uh, review time, we, weekend, especially Saturday and Sunday, it's like, you know, about the bonding time with the family. It is correct. But meanwhile, you know, 24 hours, you do have and I do have, we need to uh, manage our time wisely. 
It's like sometimes, you know, more put more efforts on the uh, so weak areas, subjects, and then spend more time, um, you know, developing or practicing and then exercising your subjects. Especially the, um, you know, um, spiritual skill too. Uh, when you face some academic challenge, you may ask your mom and dad or teachers. That's probably the first person you may just, you know, imagine or think of. But I would like to you know, encourage you at this moment, this season, this semester, when you face some academic challenges, when you face any physical challenge, when you face any you know, difficult moments, let's pray. Pray to God, depend on God, lean on God, and then get a strong faith in God and then ask God about inspiration, wisdom to resolve the problems. Especially high school students, uh, you prepare the college, and there's a lot of pressure you may have on your shoulders. So do not worry too much. Why? Because God knows your prayer topics. But you need to keep knocking the door of heaven, and then keep asking God through your prayer time. Every morning, before you go to bed, even every single moment, study time, test time, quiz time, elementary school students, maybe weekly tests, Maybe a weekly chapter, and uh, maybe I ready test this week. We're gonna have middle school, a lot of homework. Maybe more pile up, and high school, maybe college goal. You do have what you need. That at is called spiritual skill, which is the prayer and faith. Second thing is practice. Study, make it study as a what habit. Enjoy. I know it's difficult. Definitely difficult. There's no one who loves maybe study except me. So um, um, guess what? You know, try to find out you know, your interesting activities, sports and music, maybe uh, the arts and the literature, MUN and the uh, media club, a lot of, you know, the puzzle, maybe like, you know, some arts and, ha you know, arts and craft, some activities you do have on campus. Enjoy and join these opportunities, especially the uh, uh, literature people, the, the uh, student ASP, and those who are going to follow and support high school students, middle school, middle you know, school students, elementary school students, even this one community, which is what work together, become one body. So, you know, no matter what your age, the grades, first grader to twelfth graders, you guys work together, support each other. Why? Because we serving the Lord as what under the same name, Juniper Christian School. And then, you know, how do you start your semester? You need to get interest. Once again, interest, without interest, you have no idea how to start. Not only study, but the other areas, the prayer part, and your relationship with your friends, and the relationship with your teachers, and your parents. Try to get what? Interest. I'm interested in helping someone. I'm interested in supporting someone. I'm interested in starting something. I'm interested in what? Learning something. Interest. Without interest, you are not able to seriously go to any sports. You're not able to join any activities. Maybe just to become observers, it is called. Being passive. I want to encourage you guys during this semester, be active, proactive. Any areas, you have to do that. And then humility and as willingness. Humility and willingness means what? You want to learn and grow up every moment willing to learn you are uh, be humble to what uh, learn from someone and adapt from someone and you are you willing to help someone so this is the key two key the main key words that continually you are going to grow and then become the strong leaders and the last one this one set up the goals your life goal, high school students, middle school students, elementary school students, each grade, each age, you do have a life goal and spiritual goal. And the goal, when you set up this one, every moment you wake up that, you know, with this prayer, confession, Lord, I do have daily goal. I do have weekly goal. I do, I do have a monthly, yearly, my life goal. Please help me to fulfill this goal for your glory. God will listen to you, your prayer, and God will answer to fulfill your goal. 
I want to see, you know, um, your confession every moment. We want to see, we want to hear your confession every moment that we're working together to achieve your goal, you know, while completing the journey of this semester, your 2020-2021 spring semester. We are so excited. We are about to start. Why? Because you are here, your parents is here, and a lot of people, those who praying, praying and supporting, you know, for our community, they are here. And God is here. That's why we are so excited. Let's start together. Let's have a good, fun journey with Jesus Christ to complete and have a strong, the meaningful semester in the name of Jesus Christ. Let's bow our heads. Jesus, we thank you for your grace, which is gathering together. And we're about to start right now. Our school is about six years right now. What a great journey we went through. And then we thank you so much for your blessing. And we're about to start new semester, spring semester. Be with us and bless us, each one of us. Protect us from all the disease and dangerous situations and difficult moments and then make us stronger and then strong faith we could have to depend and follow you. When you, have, you know, finish up this semester, everyone, we want to confess that you have done for us. Thank you so much. That's why we're so excited. Be with us. I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Huh? <laughs> 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 자, 시작하겠습니다.